What is going on guys? It's Zorb here and today we're going to be going over 5 of the best ways to regain high ground in Fortnite. Um, I have 5 techniques that I use um, every single day when I play Fortnite to regain high ground. Um, some of them are very commonly used and I think they'll help you out for them, some of you that are trying to get a little bit better at uh, build fighting and don't know how to retake high ground. So I hope you enjoy and uh, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Appreciate it and uh, enjoy the video. Peace. So for our first technique, it's just a simple little spin move to uh, get around somebody's ramp and get high ground quickly. Um, I don't use this technique too often um, because I'm not the greatest at it, but it's still a technique that you should all know and uh, use. For a second technique, we just have the pyramid strat, which is very, very commonly used at this current time. And it seems like a lot of people are, are now using pyramids a lot. Um, it's very helpful to stop your enemy when they get their ramp over you. And you can also box them in and trap them, which is very useful. Um, it also stops them for a second, which helps you uh, get high ground. And if you do box them in, you can place a double trap on both sides and usually get a free kill. So this is basically part two of the last technique. Um, basically you're pyramiding, but it's when the stairs don't align. Um, for this one I just showed that instead of trap killing them, I just showed a way to get high ground um, by pyramiding them. For our third technique, we just have a simple double ramp with one ramp above you and one ramp under you. The upper ramp to protect you so that you can't get shot out. This is probably one of the most common uh, strats to get high ground in the game. Um, it's very easy to do, but the one thing is it's very easily countered, especially in this current meta um, with how weak wood is. Um, you can get shot out very, very easily. So if you're going to do this, I would not build out too far. I'd say two or three max. For a fourth technique, we have a very well-known strat, which is the bounce pad strat, which gives you high ground very, very easily. The only downside to this is that it's very hard to do a full 360 and build all around you, like a full one by one. So usually people just kind of do two, two walls all the way up. Um, it's very easily shot out, but the thing is if they do shoot you out, you kind of just fall back down on your bounce pads. So it is very good if you do have bounce pads to use this. And especially in this current situation that I'm showing where somebody is very, very high and if you ramp at them or something, you'll get shot out. So this is very good if somebody is a lot higher than you and you want to get up to their level very quickly. So for our fifth and final technique, uh, this is the quad ramp. So it's when you're turtling and your your opponent is above you and you want to try to retake high ground. Uh, the quad ramp is very good. It is a little bit more challenging than the double ramp, but it is a lot harder to shoot out. They have to shoot out four different things to shoot you out. And by the time you do that, you'll pretty much just be on top of them. So this one is a very good strat to do, especially if you can master it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. The reason why I made this video was I had a lot of my viewers asking me how to get high ground um, when somebody else has it. And I've been trying to make this video for about two months and it's been very difficult because I've been procrastinating and also because Playground wasn't out. But now since it's out and stuff, it was very easy to make this video and I will have more tip videos in the future. So be sure to subscribe and like and do all that good shit. And uh, yeah, have a good day. See ya.